everybody, welcome back. It arrived today. This is my Paul Reed Smith S-E C-E. This is my first PRS guitar. Um, it is an import, not the uh, American version of their guitars, the core line. This is their SE line, which is their Indonesian Cortec um, manufactured instruments. Um, they're made well. I'm very impressed with the quality control from PRS. This guitar came with, um, you know, I wouldn't say perfect frets, but pretty darn good. They're not sharp. Um, and, you know, they don't rip the fingers. Um, the uh, string height on this thing was perfect out of the box. I like the action just as it is. It was intonated, no buzzing. So again, kudos to PRS for setting this thing up before they shipped it out. Um, it's a beautiful guitar. It really is. This is their 2024 line, I believe. It was just released in October. Um, this is, again, their, their uh, 24 fret version, uh, CE, and I think the CE guitars, the original um, core CEs that were made in the U.S. were bolt-ons, the first bolt-ons from PRS. And this is a bolt-on neck. But I actually like the heel of this. I prefer this to the set neck uh, version of the SE. This is easier to access and more comfortable to the hand uh, at the heel. And yeah, I really like it. Um, as you can see, it's contoured. It's got a beautiful maple um, finish, three-piece maple body on the back of the guitar. Excuse me, mahogany, not maple. This is mahogany, three-piece. Um, the top of the guitar has a maple cap. It's a veneer. And uh, beautifully done with the flame. I love this color. It's blood orange. This guitar comes in uh, several different colors. Black cherry, the blood orange, which I'm showing you now, which I have turquoise, and also vintage sunburst. And the vintage sunburst, to my eyes at least, looks more like a cherry sunburst finish. But they're all beautiful. Um, 24 frets, as I mentioned before. This is a rosewood fretboard. It has the birds, right? The PRS birds uh, on, on the um, inlays. And it has the owl because you can only get the owl if you have a 24 fret uh, PRS. So you have the owl as the last fret. Um, it has a tremolo system. It's the PRS, um, molded tremolo system. I don't use the tremolo bar, so it's not attached. Um, 10 inch radius on the neck. Very, very comfortable neck. Um, and what I like about this model is it is not glossed. So it has, a, an almost a non-finish neck feel on the back of the neck. And uh, you can see here, um, the scarf joint on the neck as well. So it's a beautiful feeling neck. It's thin, but not, you know, thin to the point like an Ibanez where it might be too thin. It's perfect. I love it. Um, what else? It's got um, PRS 85 slash 15 S um, humbucker pickups on this guitar. Two of them, one in the bridge, one in the neck position. And it has a coil pull on the tone knob to split these coils to get more tonality out of the guitar. Um, Three-way switch. Again, one volume, one tone. What else do we have to talk about? Um, oh, the tuners. They are just, you know, typical PRS stamped tuners. They get the job done. I wouldn't say they're the best. I mean, if you're a, a gigging performer, um, playing out or um, a studio guy, you probably want to upgrade these, I would think, because they do, you know, tend to get a little sharp at times, but not bad. I mean, if you're an at-home, not you know, hobbyist, novice like myself, they're more than sufficient. Uh, what else do we have to talk about with this guitar? Weight-wise, I would say it's a light guitar. Um, I would guess this thing weighs under eight pounds. I haven't weighed it yet. Uh, just got this thing basically. Um, Indonesian made, I think I mentioned before, out of the Cortec factory. Has the painted headstock, the black headstock that goes back to when these things were core models when they first came out. Um, they had the black headstocks and they went back to that on this model. 
yeah, I mean, it's a nicely done import version of their guitar. Really, really well made. And the best part is you can get these things at a really good price now if that's something you're looking for. PRS is running 20% off on their SE models, certain SE models at least, um, until the end of the year. So I bought this for 20% off. It was $5.59, normally $6.99, which is a fantastic price on this guitar. I got it from Sam Ash. They delivered it uh, just about a week later, which is fine. And um, yeah, so uh, again, no issues with the purchase. Like the guitar. Now all I have to do is figure out how to play it, and I'll be in good shape. But um, what else do we have to talk about here? Um, I think I covered... Oh, it comes with a gig bag. That's the other thing. So, here it is. This is... PRS gig bag with the front, you know, um, pocket on it. It's padded. Um, for the fact that they throw this in or include it in the price, however you want to look at it, it's a great deal. This is a decent, decent gig bag, especially if you're taking it out and, you know, traveling with it. It will protect the guitar. Uh, okay. Uh, that's it. Again. What really attracted me to this thing was the look. I really like this blood orange color. I like the fact that it has the wood, you know, coming through here on the cutout. And the back of the guitar has the wood finish, mahogany wood finish on it. Um, it's a really sharp looking guitar, and I also like the neck. So let's, um, let's see what this thing sounds like with, you know, clean and, uh, and crunch. So here's clean. We'll play it um, the, with both... Um, the humbucker engaged as well as the coil engaged, so it splits the coil. Here's the neck. That's the neck pickup, humbucker, neck pickup, split. It's in the single coil or split mode for the neck. Here is the bridge pickup humbucker mode. And with the coil split on the neck. Middle, which are both pickups engaged. This is single. So this is with the coil um, on, so it's just splitting the coil, and now the humbucker. So obviously, it's pretty much what you'd expect, right? When the humbucker is engaged, volume increases, the thickness increases. Here's without, here's with. Especially in the middle position with these two pickups engaged as opposed to just the um, neck position, you really hear a significant volume increase when you have the humbucker versus the split. Um, and now we will play what the bridge sounds like um, with the humbucker engaged. with some single notes with, again, um, just the humbucker and then with the split. Okay, here's the humbucker engaged with, and I'll go through all three pickups. <laughs> Now, 
split. distortion. much of a noticeable difference in thickness or volume as there is when playing clean. And that might be a design point of the pickups or just my amp. I don't know. But that's what I'm observing here. Um, we will play some individual notes with distortion on um, in the humbucker mode. <laughs> session here. So that is the PRS SE CE in blood orange. First impression. I love it. I think it's a great looking guitar. I think it is a, a good deal. Um, if you want to break into a, a PRS line and not totally break the bank, uh, if you can get these things at 20% off, I think it's a good deal. Um, they're finished nicely color is beautiful um, the quality control is great from PRS um, I have no complaints so that's my story and I'm sticking to it um, if you like these videos please subscribe uh, if you have any questions put them below I'll do my best to answer them and as always guys until the next time be well and stay safe take care <laughs>